Please put on a headphone to hear the Quiet Comfort 45's active noise canceling. The Bose Quiet Comfort is almost the perfect headphone. Starting with its light design, I almost forget these are on during long sessions. It's easy to fold for travel. It also doesn't have a dust and waterproof IPX rating, so these are not meant for extreme outdoor activities. There's almost a non-existent clamping pressure, and while the ear cuffs don't look like much, they should comfortably sit on and surround most ears. After long uses, my ears were warm but never hot. The controls are simple with five buttons. You have your on, off, and Bluetooth pairing button. You have your toggle between active noise canceling and ambient mode. You have your center button, which is for your playing, your pausing. If you press two times, it'll skip to the next track. Press three times and it will go back to your previous track, as well as tactile volume buttons. As for the sound, hear for yourself. Also, listen to the active noise canceling of the Bose QuietComfort 45s with a close competitor, the Sony 1000 XM4s. The ANC is phenomenal. With these on, I couldn't hear someone knocking on the door six feet away from me, while my girlfriend could hear it all the way at the end of our apartment. As for the microphones and voice isolation, check this out. This is the sound of the Bose Quiet Comfort 45s in a very noisy environment. How do the microphones sound? So this is the sound of the Bose Quiet Comfort 45s. How does that sound? These are the Sony's excellent floors in a very windy environment. How does that sound? These are the Sony XM4s outside in the windy environment. How does that sound? Now, these do have the Bose Music app, which is practically useless. It's the visual representation of things you can already do with this headset. It does have a tip or a guide on how to use certain buttons, which is better than nothing. It lasted a clear 24 hours with ambient sound or hear through, but there aren't any options to turn them off. It's just ambient sound or active noise canceling, no passive noise canceling. Battery life would be a game changer if you could turn off active noise canceling or ambient sound and just use it passively. For the quality of features and comfort, these stand at a reasonable $329, cheaper than the Sony 1000 XM4s. But I'm assuming these will frequently go on sale the same as the Sony 1000 XM4s. I'd recommend these for everyone and for any use, except for people who are using it for fitness or outdoor activities. I have links down in my description where you can buy your very own. Subscribe if you liked my review and want to see more, like my Jabra Elite 3 review.